Football season is here, kind of. The Gophers began their prep work for the 2023 season with spring ball practices today. And the players now have 15 opportunities to impress the coaches and inch one step closer toward a starting spot. Our Ahmad Hicks has more. You know, guys, the calendar says spring has officially sprung, but standing outside of the University of Minnesota and their football facility right now, I don't think spring has actually sprung, but the calendar says it did, and that means one thing. Football is about to begin here on the campus of the U. The Gopher spring ball practices are ramping up today, and there are no shortage of storylines heading into this season. Like, who are the stars that are going to replace Tanner Morgan, Mo Ibrahim, and John Michael Schmitz? Those are a lot of questions that we have right now as media members, but head coach PJ Flex says we won't have those answers for another six weeks. He says the thing he loves most about spring ball is the competition it brings. He says as the head coach, he's responsible for creating creating the initial depth chart, but he says the depth chart will be finalized by the players as they will have the final say so. The people on the field are my responsibility because I'm putting them on the field, but players make the depth chart. I love day one depth charts because when you get to day 15 of spring ball, when you remake the depth chart, a lot of times that guys that were number one, well, they're not number one anymore. And that's not my fault. So you got beat out. And that's what's so fun about being able to create competition constantly. Now, with the addition of the transfer portal, head coach PJ Flex says there will be a lot of new gophers on the roster in 2023, and he expects some of them to be stars of the future. Now, as far as the gophers pass rush, that was one area of concern in 2022. PJ Flex said they brought in analysts and specialists to help the gophers improve. He says there's three phases of it, a spring ball phase, a summer training phase, and then a training camp phase. He said their goal, though, get after the quarterback in 2023. And that'll do it for our first spring ball report from the U. I'm Ahmad Hicks, Fox 9 Sports. Yeah, spring practice with snow. I was going to say, there's still snow out there. Going to be for a little bit yet.